Hello guys. Just imagine you can create cities with just a few clicks, set up realistic skies in seconds, automatically organize UV maps or grow, or simulate organic structures based on your preferences. Well, you don't have to imagine it anymore because in this video, I will tell 10 completely free add-ons for Blender 3D that are capable of doing these complex tasks in just a matter of seconds also before we begin, I want to tell you that if you are new here, you will find out more useful tips, artwork, animation videos on my channel. So if you want to be better, subscribe to Atomium to not miss cool videos. So let's begin with the first free add-in, which is Blender GIS. GIS stands for Geographic Information System. This add-in can produce realistic landscapes, and large precise environment for maps and satellite data seamlessly, integrating real-world maps and landscapes directly into the 3D modeling environment with the ability to import maps, satellite images, and terrain data directly into Blender. To use this add-on, your Blender version must must be at least 2.8 and higher, and it is available for free on platforms like GitHub or Blender Market. The next add-in is GeoScatter. This add-in allows users to effortlessly scatter objects like trees, grass, rocks, or any chosen elements across terrains, bringing diversity to their landscapes with support for various scattering modes. Users gain control over the distribution and density of the scattered objects, while additional features enable randomization of rotation and scale for a more realistic scene. The process is straightforward, but despite scattering custom objects, GeoScatter comes with biome presets that you can easily add to your scene. With one single click, you can add whole biomes or scatter single layers, which is pretty cool. It is compatible with Blender versions 2.8 and newer, and you can find and download this Blender add-in on GitHub. For camera and perspective alignment, there is an add-in called FSpy that serves as a valuable tool for both beginners and experienced. Blender users offering a simplified step-by-step -step solution for matching 3D scenes to real-world photos with precision. This add-in simplifies the process by enabling users to import real-world camera data into Blender and align 3D scenes accurately with images. FSpy is compatible with Blender version 2.8 newer, and you can download this add-in from on GitHub. Also, the FSpy software can be downloaded from their official website. If you like hard surface modeling, but you can't afford add-ons like Hard Ops Machine or Box Cutter, Machine 3 Tools is a perfect free alternative with almost similar set of features. This add-on is a powerful enhancement for Blender, specifically crafted to make hard surface modeling easier it streamlines workflows. It is compatible with Blender versions 2.8 and newer, and you can download it from GitHub. The next add-on is called Differential Growth. This add-on is specifically designed to create organic shape structures that mimic natural growth. The algorithm that simulates organic growth is driven by the vertex weight group. This setup you can create different variations of growth and create complex organic shapes that would be hard to model manually, also like others. The minimum required version is Blender 2.8 and you can download this add-in from GitHub. Next add-in is Real Sky. This add-in transforms the Blender experience by offering realistic and dynamic sky simulations. This add-in can deliver even more natural lighting than environment textures with the advantage that the sky setup is fully adjustable. Real Sky is compatible with Blender versions, 2.8 newer downloaded from GitHub. The next add-in is called UV Squares. This add-in is very simple as it saves your time on unwrapping, as sometimes UV map is distorted and unevenly scaled. While this add-in organizes them into neat squares, 
making everything look clean. It works with Blender 2.8 or newer, and you can find it on GitHub. Now jumping straight to texturing this next add-in called Anti-Seam. We all use image textures or PBR materials, but once they're tiled, you can always see the texture repetition, which looks very unprofessional. So how can you get rid of this pattern? The Anti-Seam add-in automatically minimizes the visibility of seams and repeating patterns with only one single node group that transforms the tiling to a new pattern that never repeats itself. The next add-in is my personal favorite, as it offers a powerful way to create buildings with just a few clicks. Sounds like a dream, right? But it can be done in real. It is a geometry node-based system, meaning you can create an infinite variation of any building and adjust any setting or value because the buildings are totally procedural. It allows you to control over building dimension styles and roof types. To use this add-in, your Blender version must be at least 2.8 or higher, and you can find it on GitHub. The last add-in on today's list is dedicated to textures, more specifically, PBR materials. Easy PBR is an add-in that connects the asset library from Ambient CG and other sources directly to Blender 3D, so you can easily add any material from this library to your object without ever leaving Blender and searching it on Google. To access them from one place, you must have Blender version 2.8 or higher, and you can download it from GitHub. So that's all from my side. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and share among your fellow creators. See you in the next one. Till then, keep creating.